At least four people have died as a result of Super Typhoon Yagi, the strongest storm to hit Asia this year, which made landfall in northern Vietnam. With gusts of up to 203 km per hour, 126 miles per hour, the storm made landfall in the provinces of Haiphong and Quang Nin early on Saturday, according to the Indo-Pacific Tropical Cyclone Warning Center. Buildings and cars have been damaged by strong winds and flying debris, and falling trees have caused power outages in Hanoi, the country's capital. According to state media, one person died in Haiduong, which is close to Hanoi, while three more died in the northern province of Quang Nin on Saturday. It's estimated that 78 persons have been hurt in the area. At sea, 12 fishermen have gone. Missing. Metal roof sheets and commercial signboards were reportedly spotted flying around Haiphong, according to news agency AFP. It follows Yagi's destructive devastation on Friday on the island of Hainan, which is known as China's Hawaii and is a popular tourist destination. The typhoon has caused roughly 100 injuries and at least three deaths in China. The two million person city of Haiphong, which is located on the northern Vietnamese coast, has been hit hardest by the storm. Parts of The city, which is home to multinational factories, experienced power outages on Saturday, and for the most portion of the day, four of the airports in the north were closed. Vietnamese coastal towns have seen the evacuation of about 50,000 residents. And authorities have issued an order to stay indoors. Hanoi and 12 other northern provinces have closed their schools. Vietnam State Meteorological Service reported that the storm was still generating winds of up to 102 km per hour, 63 miles per hour, as it advanced inland at 20 hundred hours local time, 1400 hours British summer time, on Saturday. By then, the storm's center was shown to be southwest of Hanoi. On satellite images, and by Sunday night, it was predicted to have moved into the northernmost part of Laos. Since the beginning of Saturday, Haiphong and Quang Ninh had seen more than 20 centimeters of rain. Images of motorcyclists in Hanoi Seeking cover under bridges from the intense rain were released by the state media. In the capital, the storm also brought down a two-story house that was in the midst of being demolished, according to officials, so it was unoccupied. I've never seen a storm like this, Hanoi resident Dang Van Phuong told Reuters. These winds make driving impossible. In advance of Yagi's arrival on Friday, China evacuated almost 400,000 residents from Hainan Island. Schools were closed, and there were no flights, trains, or boats operating. Approximately 830,000 households were impacted by the severe power. Outages, according to local media. Additionally, valuable crops have been destroyed. Social media videos posted in China depict windows being torn out of tower blocks located in Hainan. A Category 5 hurricane is equal to a super typhoon. Since it Landfall in the northern Philippines early this week, Yagi, the second strongest typhoon of the year, has intensified twice as much. At least 13 people were killed in the northern Philippines by floods and landslides caused by Yagi, forcing hundreds of residents to flee to safer ground. According to scientists, climate change is making typhoons and storms stronger and more frequent. Higher wind speeds are caused by storms gaining more energy due to warmer ocean waters. Additionally, a warmer environment retains more moisture, which may result in heavier rainstorms.